An update from the Wood TV Live Desk will begin momentarily. This is the Wood TV Live Desk. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. We've been doing a lot of weather here the past couple of days. We're going to step back from that for just a moment to introduce a new member of our team here at Wood TV. Marley Weirdo joins us. Marley, welcome to the team here at Wood TV. Jack Dole is also joining us here. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Yeah, thank you so much for having me. I'm really excited to get started here. Yesterday was my first day, um, so looking forward to uh, what, what's to come. But I, I'm originally from South Florida, so um, my my first day here in Grand Rapids was a little bit of a, a rude awakening. First day to come into with the it. snow <laughs> and the blizzard and all that. But um, I'm coming from Champaign, Illinois, um, from another station there, and I'm excited to to join the team and cover all the the sports we have here in in Michigan. And it's a it's a little bit of a full circle moment for me to come back to Grand Rapids as well. I played volleyball at Ithaca College, oh, nice. and we played played in the final four here in Grand Rapids so it's it's kind of cool to be back in the city and the same place where you know was one of the best moments of my volleyball career where at at Ithaca no where oh. uh, it, here in town oh here in town we played at Calvin at the Calvin nice. arena I don't know the name of it but nice. um, yeah we played at, on Calvin's campus oh cool what uh, what was one of the best things that you covered during your time there it was champagne you said right? yes what yeah. was what was one of the best events or, or games that you did cover yeah I mean there were so many but I just go back to the Big Ten tournament last year I guess yeah so 2021 um, it was you know the Big Ten tournament after the other one had been canceled um, so it was cool to come back and watch Illinois the team that I was covering at the time um, win the championship it was it was a really cool moment and to be one of the few credentialed media allowed into uh, into the stadium because there there were fans it was very limited and they even limited how many media credentials that were even given out so it was a, a humbling moment to be a part of that experience um, and get to win you know, a cool part of history and, you know, watch some, some good basketball as well. Going to have to transition from the Illini to Michigan. Yes. Michigan State. <laughs> I am. And my parents are kind of happy about that. Um, I did grow up in a Big Ten household. Both my parents went to University of Michigan. So I think they kind of tried to become the bandwagon Illinois fans. <laughs> but now I think maybe they're they're happy to for me to be on the beat of, you know, a team that they like rooting for. Nice. Jack, how exciting is it to have a new member of the team? It's great. Um, you know, we, we're, we miss Larry. We miss Seth. They did a great job for us. Larry, you know, 20 years in that chair. But uh, it's, it's fun to have some fresh new blood, so to speak. Uh, fresh new ideas, view, a new point of view. Uh, and, you know, just some new energy in the sports office. And, uh, you know, we had about 80 candidates for the, the two jobs. Wow. And uh, Marley really stood out right away. She was the first person I contacted of all the people we've talked to the first person I contacted um, and part of that was a reference from someone I know that was her competition in that market said you really should look at her so um, I did I was very impressed with her work and uh, we're really happy that we were able to land her here uh, because I, I think you're gonna see her doing bigger and better things down the line um, 
but right now it's it's going to be exciting to see her work here because I think she's going to add a lot to this uh, this market, this station, this department. Oh, kind words, thank you. <laughs> Speaking the truth. So what's first here? Like what uh, what do we have in the docket here in the first week or two? What's first? I mean, we're just um, learning the ropes a little bit. I know I am um, on deck for the Hope Calvin basketball game next week, which yeah. I heard is is very big. Um, I'm excited um, to see see what it's like. I know you know. I'm familiar with Calvin Volleyball, obviously, because we've played them before, but I'm excited to see what that competition looks like on, on the basketball front. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. But other than that, just kind of learning the market, um, looking forward to getting out in the community and meeting some people. I went to the uh, Grand Rapids Gold game last night. Um, so it, it's just, you know, feet in the water still. I'm waiting to, to dive head first, but um, it's exciting and uh, looking forward to getting out and, and covering some some stories. And it's you're going to see a a lot of Marley really soon because you know I'm getting ready to go out to Beijing I'll be gone That's for right. a month and so she'll take over my spot you're gonna see her a lot um, <laughs> get so, used to it guys. Yeah. <laughs> and maybe you won't want me back <laughs> I think what we're gonna see though is we're gonna really you gotta uh, introduce her to the market uh, give her some stories to get out and tell so people can see her ability to do that um, but you're gonna see her on air a lot so you know I'll be behind the scenes probably next week trying to make sure that you know she knows how to do everything she knows how to do needs to know how to do in our system because she knows how to do everything it's just a new system you've got to pick up and learn and sure. uh, she's picked it up she even showed me a couple things on the editor last night so. <laughs> nice. gotcha. When do you take off for that, Jack? I leave on the 27th nice. of January. So that's three weeks. Yeah. Three weeks uh, from today, right? So that's coming up fast. And so we've got a lot of Olympic stories to get out and tell. Marley will get out. I'll get out. Um, and we hope to have another new person in here in the coming weeks, hopefully before I leave or it'll happen while I'm gone. But nice. uh, we've, we've got somebody else we're very interested in that we're, we're negotiating with now. And if, uh, if we have this team together, I think uh, it's going to be really great for for all of us. Well, Marley, we're happy to have you. Anything yeah. in closing, either of you? Um, I don't know. Just thanks for having me. This was fun. A good little introduction. Yeah, um, yeah I'm just excited. I haven't had a chance to, I mean, meet everybody in this building yet, so I'm looking forward to, to getting around and meeting some of the new faces. And, yeah, I think it's going gonna, it's gonna to be fun. Yeah, <laughs> right now we're planning on having Marley uh, co-host the um, – the sports Friday night with all the high school and all the other activities. Very so exciting. That's the first time you'll probably see her on air unless we have some breaking news that needs to get <laughs> You never know. Uh, but, yeah, and then we'll, we'll see her this weekend as well. So you're going to see a lot of Marley Weirda really soon and uh, less of me, and that's probably good for everybody. <laughs> well, very exciting. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been a look at the Wood TV Live Desk. Thank you for joining us, and have a great afternoon.